Hey friends, it's uh, it's that time again. So uh, let's play again. Let's do some more playing. Uh, let's keep keep this adventure rolling here. We're running through the ruins. We're gonna do a nice cool leap over to some new enemies here. Some floor slimes and floaty heads. As we uh, make our way through, oh, this is the wrong way. Um, a couple of, uh, a couple more of these. I think we're done in this room. Ah, it is. It's good to freedom our way around the place here. Um, yeah. These little statues don't, they're very peaceful. They're very peaceful until you get close and then they're very vengeful. There's also like a little bit of a hitbox uh, um, technique there to, to utilize standing free of their of their attacks. I'll find some more in a bit here and, and show you what I mean. Oh, ooh, please explode something. Yay. That is so helpful. for the lion again. Nope, not quite enough. I'm recording today in the studio and I forgot to... I forgot to <laughs> close the door. Now my cats are in here. So we're gonna, we're gonna keep playing. We're gonna have some faith that they're not going to <laughs> disrupt the, the show. If they do, well, that's on me. Let's get the in here. That's what I thought. There is... I want to say there is only... Um, I'm acting like I, I don't know. I'm 99% sure that there is only one single red jewel in this whole dungeon, so... Uh, which I don't think we've got yet. It'll be coming up here shortly, though. Oh, those sneaky, sneaky guys. Um, this switch makes them start attacking you. That was a, <laughs> that was thrilling. But yeah, I stay um, below them as I swing because it's still registering hits. Um, Keeping our nice, beautiful blonde hair safe. Getting kind of low on the cliffs here. A little, uh, a bit foggy. Which I'm pretty sure means we're we're getting near the end of this uh, fun little fun little dungeon dive. Oh, another ladder to explode into place for me. I'm not taking that up. This is going to get you back towards the the entrance to the opposite of where we want to go. Um, okay. Kind of helps to orient me. Checking that um, that map real quick. We definitely don't want to miss out on any stats as we approach the end. You will see why shortly. Goodness, these guys right here, hold on, right in the middle. Yeah. I remember those I remember those guys being an issue, um, luckily here. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, knock all these things off. Just frantically <laughs> literally just swing your sword around like a little little cyclone there. And a little sword cyclone custom move is well how we uh, handled that. Um, we've been in this room before just from another angle, so it won't take us long to clear this one out. 
I want to say, oh, yay, oh, yeah, we need that. Okay, good. There it is. That should be our red jewel. Got a little bit buffer, got ourselves a red jewel. And uh, we're gonna hop in into this dark space. You need to trust me here. Young Will needs to step out and shine for a moment again. Top off, uh, top off your life. All right, back to this room that we were just in. And uh, here it is, the golden room. The golden room is where I have a, a secret audience that wants to hear this cool wind melody. I think one of the skeletons that I just passed gives you like a hint to do this. When touched, yeah, by the echo of the flute, the gold block began to glow. Um, I it, It's literally just this one. It's not the one that you're standing on. It's always this one down here. You have to just sit here and stand on it. Like, I don't know what that was, seven seconds for this doorway to appear. Um, but now that we're here, this is a bittersweet moment here. Our cool little Incan statue collection. We're gonna show off here. We worked very hard to earn these and it's time to say goodbye to them. We need it to be Will, because Frieden is just a... Look, he's a nice guy and all, but playing the flute is not his strongest suit. So, yeah, you gotta get Will to step in there, take care of that, and then and then we bring Frieden back. We bring Frieden back for the, the heavy hit in here. That's about to uh, arise. Cool. The wind uh, flew us over here. Um, enter, enter only when you're you want you you're comfortable with the point of no return. God, this guy looks so intense. Literally f fighting a giant demon. That's cool. Fight him by hitting him in the fingers. He hates he hates being hit in the fingers. Now we hit him in the face a bunch. I'm just gonna kind of take some hits. The goal is I want to get his life uh, far enough down so that I only have to do that one more time easily. Just stand back here. You'll dodge all those lasers. Come back around front. Um, we just need to do that one more time. And one is down, and two is down. This guy's name is Castoff, according to the little companion book that comes with the game. Okay, cool. Now, he's dead. We defeated him. Will returns to his original shape. Sure, I guess so. I guess we've decided to um, to switch back, and that's fine. I don't want to freak anyone out on the other side of that door like, like we did before. Um, this guy was so, so hard. I literally was stuck on this one boss for such a long time, too. Um... Just wondering what could possibly be back here, behind him. Just kept me up at night. Um, but yes, as I said, as soon as we entered the door to do that fight, we reached the point of no return. And where we can't return back to our city that we started in. We can't go get that elusive red jewel from the fisherman from a few videos back. If you're playing this, Alongside me, you needed to go do that before we entered that door. Hopefully, hopefully you, uh, hopefully we're, we're good here. But go ahead and jump. 
jump down 10 stories onto the gold ship. Well, I feel like someone's there. The ship is in immaculate condition. And uh, yeah, there's people all over this. The king has returned and he's so much shorter. It's the king, you're safe. Oh, I'm the king? Yeah, so these guys are tripping. Guess I'm the king now. The queen is in the stateroom and show her, okay, yes. The queen, I'm sure, would love to see me, see me in, in, in good health and spirits. I wish that, um, there we go. Hey, queen. Good, you have returned safely. Very somberly uh, relieved here. As you were told, I've been guarding the mystic statue. We're supposed to get those. My flute dad told me to get all of those mystic statues. So this is great news. I'm standing right here. I really don't know why they all think I'm the king. I'm very much a 14 year old boy. Wonderful, please let me have this. Court and music. Wonderful. Will must be thrilled right now. He got one of the statues. See it on our inventory screen, chilling over there. We have clearly room for five more. So, first one down. And it's not like the easiest one to get. It's a little bit difficult fighting that boss the first time, not understanding the patterns and, and, and having kind of a short amount of life. The other thing I want to mention too, let's go to this, let, let's go to this crow's nest. I, I, I would love, I would love to go to the crow's nest right now. This is exactly where I want to be. Um, talk to my friend up here. How's it going, friend? Oh, short king, look there. The ship is coming out of the cave. <laughs> you just called the king short. You just insulted him. They must have a cool, like, king-to-guard uh, relationship. That look, doesn't that look cool? We just went from, like, zero to 60, like, so fast. So, yeah, the Incas here, I guess they're escaping on a gold ship from the invaders. Kind of historical references going on here. Fun, nice view. Um... I always loved this. You can jump off. Again, wouldn't wouldn't survive that. But Will is Will, and he's a short king, so get it, get it, Will. Um, it's pleasant. The music is great. Everyone's dancing. Everything's golden. I've got a statue, and now we're gonna take a nap. On the, on the wooden slats. Couldn't even, have, couldn't even have a golden pillow. Couldn't be bothered to have a golden, to some golden fleece to sleep under. This is totally my house. Gotta try to leave. And it's mother. The comet is so beautiful. The comet approaches. Some say it's unlucky, and some say it's lucky. The comet approaches and recedes from the Earth. That doesn't sound like it's a lucky star. I guess we're lucky that it hasn't destroyed us. So let's look at, you know, are we, you know what? How does Will want to say that? Will, Will's looking at a half full. Let's say it's lucky. All right, well then, you just hope that that happiness don't sleep away. Well, I'm always watching over you. It doesn't matter what you say there. I think you just get a different response. Let's wake back up. Oh my goodness, it's my friends! 
It's green friend and blue girl. I don't take ladders, I jump everywhere. You're back so late, the Elder must have read your fortune. He said that you were floating alone on the sea. Oh, so surprised. You were acting strange, so we followed you. We reached a strange town. It's invisible. I'd call that pretty strange. Ah. What a relief, huh? My friends are all here. Yay. A cool little thing I do want to mention before I forget. That after you beat that boss, and any boss in this game, when you beat a boss, the game catches your stats up to you. Meaning, if I hadn't cleared out rooms in the sewers, or any of those rooms in the cliffs, if I had missed out on any of those little stat increase bonuses, um, you get rewarded with them anyways just for beating that boss. It's important to know that if you're ever like speed running. Um, purple friend over here has a little gift. A strange jewel. And we know exactly what to do with that. Yes, we'll get to red jewel. Thanks purple Seth friend. We, we appreciate that. Um, I'm gonna go around and look for the rest of my friends next time. I can't wait to hear Kara not complaining about being on here. I can only assume she's on this ship because Lily is here and also my little friend Eric. I think we saw him for a second in the corner. We'll go talk to him next time. We'll see how everyone's doing. The ship looks terrible. It looks terrible. I don't know what happened, what they did. It's a beautiful sunset, but the golden shimmer has faded. Maybe a sign of things to come. Let's, let's, let's find out next time when we let's play together again. Looks like my cats were well behaved too. Side note, good job guys. Good job not disrupting the uh, video here. Anyways, have a great day uh, gaming. Like and subscribe. Oh, I hate sounding like a robot, but like and subscribe. Like and subscribe. I have I have a, in, uh, another exciting project to uh, to post up here in the in the coming weeks. So let's get excited. Have a great day gaming.